Hello you, welcome to Geekism, welcome back to Mega Aquarium, where I've got a feeling we're going to finish this one, to be honest with you, uh, and maybe even make a start on the next one in this episode, the level that is, of course. Um, we need to breed a guppy with a new pattern, we don't need to, that's just a bonus thing, uh, and we've got guppies plenty here, look, we've got guppy 60, wait, wait, you shouldn't be in there, you shouldn't be in there, bye. Yes, off you go. Thank you. Uh, you're just uh, you're just growing up. There we go. Good. And then here we've got guppy, 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 guppy. Can you see those? Where my head is? Guppy, guppy, guppy. And we have a couple of emerald guppies as well. So they're just different colours. These ones, okay. Um, they're like a a colour change. Okay, so it's hybrid. It's possible to breed hybrids of the species that vary in colour and pattern. Uh, so we've got, that's a colour mutation, new pattern might just happen, we're going to let them keep making babies, alright, and see how we get on. Uh, the main full steam ahead you win, we've just got to earn, like, we could leave the game running and we win, okay, that, that's how simple this is, right? So I don't think we're going to move over to this area, because I, I just think that we're a little bit limited with what we've got going on here, and what I would like to do is, uh, is maybe just have a go... At, um, at a at like a not necessarily a sandbox level, but but something where we've just we've got everything and we can choose what we want to. We still got to earn the stuff, you know, but we've got access to everything, which I think is an important thing, which we don't seem to have necessarily here. Um, I can't remember what we were working towards. If I'm totally honest with you, so much stuff to research. Look, uh, red tail catfish. Uh, I'm trying to think of stuff we haven't seen yet. We haven't seen catfish yet. Let's go for catfish. That's a new one. Um, so I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Would you prefer just like a not necessarily sandbox because I think just giving just having everything in this game is a little overwhelming and, and maybe not quite as fun. There is something to be said about unlocking things, but do you think maybe a level where there isn't necessarily a, a thing to do, uh, it just make a nice big space and slowly unlock stuff? Uh, do you think that would be better, or would you rather see me continue with the campaign? I'm going to let you guys decide here. Views are still doing okay for this one, considering at the moment. Um, views just on the channel in general are down at the moment, but Mega Aquarium is still holding its own. So I'm happy to kind of go either way on this one. You, you folks let me know in the comments, that'd be great. A um, couple of uh, things in the last uh, episode that somebody pointed out there. Maybe if we move this around, okay, like that, and then put this wall in here, um, that not only will it maybe neaten this up, uh, it will... It will, it will just look a little neat, so which I, which I think is a fair point, to be fair, because it's a little messy there. And it means that people can move around, so if we do that, and then if you don't want to go through the tunnel, you don't have to. And that's a fair point. There are some people who aren't going to be uh, interested in the uh, in going through the tunnel there. Some people could be a bit of a phobia of that kind of thing, you know. Two males, that's it. So Guppy has grown into just Guppy, and Guppy has grown into just Guppy. So that's rather dull. Um, but we're going to come in here, and they've all of those. Oh no, we've got to, we've got. Hold on, is this this tank? So we've got two more emerald Guppies. Okay, so let's move those to here. Okay, and then let's sell just the regular Guppies. Oh, ah, oh, no, I sold some fry then. That's annoying. Okay, so here we've got. They're all doing okay at the moment. We can clear out the guppies. I feel like we should keep the emerald ones in, or or have like guppies and emerald ones made, and that would give us a good chance of getting the of getting the the new pattern there. So, well, rather than just sit around and wait, how we do? We've got balloons being researched there. I mean, really, we should look at doing another tank then, shouldn't we? Maybe maybe this here can be a nice big tank to finish off with uh, whilst we wait for stuff to happen. So. Let's just kind of block this area off to give us some space to work with without everyone wandering off up here. Okay. And then we'll clear this out. Like that. And then this blob here can be the tank. So what have we got? Have we got like a big tank that we haven't done yet? I suppose we've got the jetty tank there that people can look out over. Um... You know, other than that, it's just regular big tanks. I suppose a jetty tank would be something a bit different to finish off with then, eh? So, if we drag that like that, we've unlocked the balloon shelf. And we will finish off with... Uh, 
I mean, I don't even know whether we're going to... Oh, U-Tank, feeding platform tank. We've got to unlock that at some point, but I don't think we're going to do it here. Let's do the copper van toy. Okay. See, this is what happened last time. You, somebody wandered off through the wall as I built the tank, which is a little unfortunate. So if we do something like this... Okay, and then we can put a wall in there. Great. And it's just surrounded by wall, this one. Okay. Yeah. Now, the main thing we need at the moment, though, is a way for them to get into this area, which we don't have, right? Yeah, they're all walking up here and seeing nothing. We haven't actually got a, a way in, so we're going to have to make a little adjustment here. So, let's get rid of that trash can, and let's move you, no, not you, mister, sorry, you, down to here. And then we can put a door in there, then. Boop. Uh, doors. Okay. So now staff can get back here. Uh, oh, the other thing that people mentioned is I'm not putting down enough, uh, like, tool sets and stuff, which, again, perfectly acceptable. So let's get a few of those around the place. Um, like here, for instance, there just isn't one for people to get to that thing easy enough. Uh, over here, probably could do with one. Um... Um, maybe even up here have we got one. So no, we haven't even got one in here. Look. And therefore, so basically, wherever there's a little setup of things, there needs to be toolboxes. I feel like we have them here. Yeah, we've got two there. That's good. Okay. And I think we probably could do with some more staff as well. Let's take them all. We've got loads of cash, and we don't particularly need much. So Guppy22 is pregnant. Nice. Tinfoil Barb has grown, and Tinfoil Barb has grown. So where are you? Let's make sure that that growing hasn't done us a disservice it has so what's up with you now you're hungry okay well there's more staff that shouldn't be a problem and i'm guessing these oh no you're both running okay you just haven't got enough filter now they've grown up all right well let's stick a little uh protein skimmer in there no oh you're fresh water okay well you can have a nitrite reactor And then we need the the RO membrane things as well, don't we, to fill that up when they need to. So I'm hoping somebody comes in here and feeds you pretty soon. That'd be nice if they did. So Guppy was pregnant. It wasn't actually telling me that anything was... Uh, oh, here could do with a, with a toolkit as well. I know there's one over there, but there's no reason why we can't give them one over this side. And we've just took a load of staff on as well, so... Should be people flooding to come and solve things now. This this is telling me that we need we need trash here. Um, we need a trash can here. These fit nicely there, so I'm happy to keep those. But I do think we need uh, some trash cans. So I mean, there's one right there, really, and they can't go on that bit. So I'm not too sure what you want me to do, really, folks. Stop making a mess. Stick one there, I guess. There's literally two trash cans right there. Mucky pups. And there can have one, all right. Um, and then just a member of staff who who has the ability to clean. We'll hopefully get up there. So what are we going to put in here then? I'd I kind of like to see catfish, to be honest. I, that's one of the few things we haven't put down yet. So I mean, clownfish. They're not really the sort of thing you would have in a big tank like that, are they? These angel fish we haven't put any down of yet. Let's see if there's any new freshwater ones. Corys. They're only tiny though. This thing wants a big fish, right? I'm going to guess this catfish goes pretty big. 12 to 42. Yeah, alright. We're going to wait for the catfish. A few things. Um, <laughs> I don't think we've got bloodworm. To feed that fish. Barber's grown. Nice. Uh, the guppies have bred. Okay, so let's sort our guppies out first. Let's move those to there. Okay, you should be quite happy there. That was an emerald guppy and a guppy as well, so that might give us the the uh, the mix that we need. Uh, okay, so we don't have bloodworm for you, which is not good. So I apologise. Let's get some bloodworm. There we go. 
There we go. If somebody could grab that really quick, that'd be great because they've been hungry for a long time now. Are you getting it? Are you getting it? Why don't you, why don't you get it? Why don't you get it? Go on, go on, please. Yeah, okay, good. So that's fine. A litter really seems to be a problem. Uh, Benny's leveled up. Cleaning. Got to get your cleaning, kiddo. Uh, Emerald Guppy 3 and Guppy 20 have bred. So that could be a nice new one. And they've bred. And Guppy 13 is pregnant as well. Okay, great. So we'll just move all the uh, those fry over. Uh, into there. Cool. So if you can hear my cat, by the way. I don't know why he's so bothery. Yeah, they're just... Oh, I've just thought... I know why I know why they're not cleaning stuff up. God, I bet you're all shouting and screaming at me. I'm so sorry. They need they need brooms to do it, right? It's a thing. Always forget about the tools. Right. Let's get these around. Come on. Let's get sweeping up. Let's go. Let's go. I'm going to put it here. Boom. Broom cupboard. And also, somebody pointed out that I gave put backpacks down and never actually gave them to anybody to do anything with. <laughs> I'm so bad at this game. I don't know why anyone watching me play. Uh, okay, that's a few brooms. Okay. Oh, we got some toy shelf. Nice. Have we got anything else we can stick in the in the shop? Uh, no. Feeding stick. What does that do? Increase the equipped staff members' feeding skill by thirty. Oh, okay. That's quite neat. Um, I really don't know. They're mega double filter, whatever. Okay, let's put some of those uh, um, toy things down because they love the uh, they love the balloons. Toy supply can go there, and I'd say it's the gift shop. Pretty good. Okay. Um, oh, what was the other thing as well I didn't do? Oh, that was blocked. Somebody, I'm sure somebody pointed that out, that that doorway was blocked. Stuff's getting picked up now. That's good. I'm hoping our prestige starts to go up a little. What have we got here? Paku has grown. Nice. We'll go and check those out. They're going to be nice and big. Guppies. Emerald Guppy again. Pregnant. Teresa's leveled up. Cleaning. Okay, so where did we put those Pakus here? Let's have a look. Are they nice and big now? Oh, yeah. Look, that's a fish. There you go. So are you full size now? 20. Awesome. Okay. Now, the other thing I noticed is that this this here, this isn't cumulative. This is like on a day, right? Unlock new animals, build new tanks, and fill them with unique combinations of animals and decorations. So, like, we're not hitting it. We're, going, we're up to 12, one, 2, 1, 5, 5 at the moment, okay? We need to up our prestige in a big way. So this might not be enough. We may have to have a bit of a redesign here. Clear this area out and come down here. Maybe, yeah, we, we, I was being a little bit optimistic because I thought this was just like cumulative. But it's not. It's over, a, looks like a day period or maybe a week period. I don't know. But we uh, we do have those catfish, those cool catfish unlocked. So red tail catfish. Let's have a look at look at these. Look, 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 look at these. So we do generate a bit of prestige off these. Quite a decent amount of prestige, actually. Okay, and ecology points. And they can get big. Um, so bigger the fish, the better. They need to be warm with a fair quality of water. They need to eat roaches. They need caves and some open space. They're greedy. Ne neutral or acidic. They're time-consuming to feed. They will eat little things anything under 16 so wow not much can go in these with, with these we can maybe move we could move pakus over to here and put some new pakus in the other one and their fresh water as well right red tail catfish then it doesn't say that we can't need to have them on their own so i reckon one two they're already a decent size aren't they look at those i'm gonna say three right okay Let's get. Let's just go all out with a with a um, with a mega heater. Mega heater is enough as it stands. Okay, that's cool. Um, do we have a mega filter? I didn't. Do did we unlock it? We have a mega filter. Plenty of filtration. That's nice. So they need roach, and the task requires skill. So let's get a. Uh, 
else. Oh, that's a point. I oh, know we don't necessarily need ladder up because they can feed off there, can't they? So they can come through this door here. So if we put the roach uh, on this side, it's going to make it a little easier. Yeah, if we put it there, they can get it in. They can come around and feed. Okay. And then they need super caves. So pity column is 11. So actually two of these is enough. Oh no. Wow, man, they love the caves. So let's, we've got to make sure there's a three by three space somewhere. So if we leave that there as three by three, or actually it's probably better to leave uh, something that is, is going underneath the thing so it's a little less interesting. Uh, oh, there we go, slate cave. Now you're talking. Let's clear out those ones and go for slate caves because they're new. And they've got a higher number as well. 17. Now, oh, yeah, look at that. So, like, not quite two of those. We'll need a couple more. Like, four more. A couple of driftwood caves just to get a bit of variation. We'll be fine. There we go. So, there's enough cavage. Now, they don't need any plants. But I, I want to give them some... So where's the floating thing? That'll look really good here. So let's have a look at our 3x3. Three three. So that can be our 3x3 three three there. So let's leave that clear. And we'll have some of you there. They look really good, especially when you're on a big tank that you're looking down into. And I don't think the Java phone's going to work for this. Probably just some little uh, swords. There we go. So you should be fine, Red Tail Catfish. Let's have a look. You've got 3x3. Three three. You've got everything you need apart from your food. You're good to go. Now, I, I am tempted. I'm tempted to move the Pakus over. They need three by three. They need plants. So I, I think that should be enough plants in there. They also plant destroy. So we might need... Uh, every plant destroyer counts as the same as three regular. There are nine plant destroyers and 39 in the tank. 39 plants in the tank. Okay, I'm going to move... I'm going to try and move you over, right? Let's have a look. Across all animals, this tank needs at least 10 plants. Does it though? Let's have a look. There are six plant destroyers and 12 in the tank, so there's a 6% chance. So we need a few more plants in there. Can we get a corkscrew? That is it, we can. We need to leave, need to leave that three by three, but there we could have some. Let's see what they say now. Now there's a 1% a chance that they'll destroy a plant. <laughs> okay, maybe I'd love to be able to get rid of that completely. So, there's that. Still a 1% chance. I, I'm going to take that risk. <laughs> Why not? Keeps his eyes open. We're probably not going to be playing long enough for them to, to know about that. So now we can come over and buy two more of those. Throw them in here. Right, because that's what was in there already. And they're, and they're happy with it. So now you've got two fully grown packs. That's a, just a big tank that you can come and look down on, right? And that's, and that's interesting and fun. So I'm going to lose a bench. I'm going to lose that bench there. And instead put in a, a, these things, because these do great. They generate prestige depending on what's in them. They generate science depending on what's in them. So we'll go for ecology. And watch this number go up. What? 2185 a day at the moment. Oh. 285. Yeah, there we go. 2 2. I don't, we ain't getting up to 3.5 with that, I'll be honest with you. Uh, our turtle's grown. Okay. And we've had some more fry. So we'll keep moving you out until we've got, because once we've got the guppy we need, I'll be honest with you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it so they can't breed, because this is fun, but I don't think it's not sort of thing I want to have constantly going on, right? And then also, when we do get rid of that, we can then bring the path through here as well. Atlantic mackerel, that's a cold water, so I might, I might lend myself towards having some more cold water stuff. 
Let's go for the lobster. And if we can't put it in the same tank, we can put them next to each other and the area's a bit more themed. And I'm drinking an empty glass. Uh, my word, all sorts of things happen then. Okay, so the jellyfish got bigger. That's good. Um, we had some guppy. We had some guppy. We can't grow that one, and we can't grow that one. We had that guppy, and somehow we made a... Uh, a Scarlet Ink? No. Hold on. What's this? <laughs> uh, base Prestige. That's good. I'm sure we can work something out. I think the other one we did, right? So what did, what did we get? What did we get? Oh, there we go. Emerald Cobra Guppy and Aqua Guppy. Ooh. Okay, so let's move those across. You, you, uh, you, you, and you. Okay, let's just sell the regular guppy because boo, boring. Okay, and the guppy fry can stay there. So here we've just got cobra, aqua, cobra, emeralds, and scarlet with the other ones we got as well. Okay, great stuff. Okay, so hopefully you just carry on. Um, and I'm gonna, I said, I was gonna say we were gonna ignore that, but base prestige is really useful because that baby bunts us up. We're now at seven twenty seven hundred, which is pretty awesome. Um, but I think otherwise, yeah, I do think we're going to have to start to bring this out into into something useful. So I started working on the feeding tank, which I think could go down the bottom here and be pretty cool. There's like a big feature. Uh, and we've got the uh, lobster on the way as well. So let's see if we can move all this around without it causing too much of an issue. So let's go move you to there. Move you to there, and let's see, you, you're the one I'm going to struggle with because you, we're keeping you kind of neat. But then oh, this could all come down, right? So that you can view the tank this way, right? Yeah, I think that's what we're going to have to do. So let's come in to find the path, uh, harbour side. There we go, and we'll bring you down to here. All right, uh, and this can be our new path. Yeah, okay, and we'll do that and that. Uh, and so we lose a bit of the bit of the sand, but I don't hate that. Um, can we put this trash somewhere a little bit more? So I suppose it can go there because now we will turn that into a wall, and this can be a tank here. Yeah, okay. So this can just be something pretty standard corner tank. Let's put a deep corner tank. I don't know what you'd. Oh, I don't want that there. At all. I could have just moved it, but you know, that's, that would be me being useful. See, actually, that's why you would, wouldn't have a deep corner tank, is because I only actually want that two wide and three. There we go. Just a little, t just a little cute little tank, eh? Do you know what? Sometimes smaller is better because we've got clownfish. Clownfish. Dead easy to keep. P proper people pleaser. They don't grow. They don't grow. They don't grow. Okay. So we need water and filter. And I don't think they need much else to be honest. But we can obviously put some things in there that look nice. Um, so uh, filter and power. That should be fine. I reckon I can put that down and, and it'd be acceptable. Look at that. How what an easy one. And orange pellets. We'll put some food down for them as well. Orange pellet dispensers. What an easy fish to look after. They are good to go. Now, obviously, that looks poop. So let's try and make it look a little nicer at least. So there's salt water. Um, I mean, really, it's it's coral, right, That they that they want, but... I'm not going to put coral in there because the fish count is already full. So I'm going to put some of that down at the front. It looks a bit corally. And I'm going to put down uh, some... Oh, is that a three-wide one? Oh, that's a shame. I'd have put that at the back. Egg rack. Um, is there a two-wide one? The culpara or the eel grass? Yeah, that'll do. There you go. Come and see the clownfish. Okay. So that's that. Now we're going to have to box this in. Just a little, at least for now. And then that's going to have to get boxed in. Again, I th I feel like 
we can make another just a pretty basic wall tank here and it's a little bit of a waste of space here this but we can you know we can maybe do something but for now that's okay i think with a big tank here at the bottom i think that's okay to have this slightly thinner corridor with not much going on it so i'm gonna put a um let's just put a a deep wall tank in right yeah with a view to yeah putting something there that that's okay it's pretty plain but i don't mind that i don't hate it so we'll put a staff door in there so they can go and use all of that that we've just done yeah okay and then we need also oh, we need another staff door now because this this area is no longer uh i'm gonna give them two ways of getting into there so i'm hoping they can feed from here now with that one wall missing. I mean, well, I guess we'll see. We'll move that toolbox into here. Let's see. Is it, where's he going with that? Is he going all the way around? Yeah, he's going to there, which is a little annoying. I don't know whether they've just figured that out later or not. Oh, we can't. See, let's do that weird thing where we can't put a wall there. We had that before, right? Well, I'll tell you what. Again. Can't do anything with it. Make a thing out of it. There goes a trash can. Now, actually, do you know what? I'm going to get rid of... Oh, no, we've got to be careful here because we've got people going to get stuck. We're going to have to move those jellyfish. Okay, this is a bigger job than I thought. We're going to have to get rid of uh, this little spot. Uh, like that, because it's about time we had some toilets in and they fit nice there. And then this area can also have um, fizzy drinks and stuff. Fizzy drinks, chocolate, and a trash can for them. Okay, so let's just wall this off because nothing's going there until we've got that jetty feeding thing. Okay. Um, all right. Okay. So we've got a we've got a bit of a move job on here. You you should be pretty simple. You should be able to just click and go down again. So boom. Okay. We can do that. This one. Uh, what's going to come with you? Okay. You're not. That's not so bad. So if we put you there, right, and then move. If we do that, that should be okay, shouldn't it? Yeah, I'm nodding at myself. I need I need to be told uh, that it's okay. And we get rid of you. There we go. Okay, and how about... Probably something goes there. I don't know. It can do that. No, that's gonna that's no good. That's going to have to go to there, isn't it? Boop, boop, boop. Uh, no, we'll keep that in. Staff door can go on it. And then we'll have one of those little sticky outy tanks. I mean No, it can't be a deep one. There's just no room for it at all. Just a normal sticky outy tank. That'll do. That's cute. Nice little tank there. There we go. Womp womp. And then we're not going to put anything in that just now anyway. So we've got two tanks that we need to work on. Okay, but otherwise, I think that's okay. I think that's going to give us enough space to finish this level. This has been a, f a really fun one, to be honest. I, I, have, I did not think we would be using the whole space here. I have enjoyed the challenge immensely. There we go. And that's what I think this game really has going for it, is that... It's got. It's not the most creative title because of the the grid system is a little limiting, and I would love to have seen decorations, especially come off the grid. That would have been superb. But saying that, the the challenge of making it all fit together, it's almost it's almost a puzzle game, you know, figuring out where the tanks fit, and also figuring out what fish can go with what and get and you get good results, you know. I think it's. Uh, 
I think it's fantastic. And and also, considering it's pretty much made by one guy, Tim uh, Wick, Wickstaff, I believe his name is, or Wickstead, maybe. Um, I think he's got some help with like music and some assets and stuff, but for the most part, it's you know he's, he's done it on his tard. It's pretty incredible. Um, I'm going to go for the Lump Sucker. Dislikes food competitors. Yeah, I'm going to go for cold water. I want cold water things. I want cold water things. Uh, and I'm going to put them in here. Coal, this is a cold water tank. So are they fresh cold waters we've been unlocking? Where's that lobster? Hmm. She's his lobster. Uh, so we've got the wrasse. They got to 14. And they will eat crustaceans sized 1 to 2. Or 1 to 5 when fully grown. And you're okay because you're already 5 and you'll grow at the same rate. So I feel like you can get together. Cockles? Dislikes kind of specific. Hairs with common. Oh, so you're a loner. Who will eat crustaceans? Ouch. Okay. Armored. Oh, okay. So you've got. The Rass has got no chance of eating you. And you're a bully. You're not a bully. Greedy. That's not a problem. You'll grow. Requires a supplement. And crab. So I feel I can go lobster. Rass. I feel like that's acceptable as a fish tank. The hell did that happen then? Oh, okay. Uh, temperature's too high. Yeah, that's fair enough. Temperature is probably too high. So cold water. So first of all, let's get a large chiller in there because it's a pretty decent sized tank. Filtration wise, I don't think we're going to need anything crazy. Probably that'll do. Yeah, okay. So, food wise, you need uh, cockles, crab, and a supplement. I'm going to move all those down here for you. So, you've got them. So, cockles, uh, a crab, and a supplement. There you go. You'll enjoy all that, won't you? And you need some. And you need twelve cave space. So I'm going to put another one of these slate ones in, because I know they're a bit overkill, but I haven't really seen them properly. Because the ones we put them in there, you can't can't really get a good look at them, can you? Because that because of how we built the walls up. Oh, talking of which, we can also remove all of this wall. Yeah, and that. Why not? You can see the guppies. Come and look at the baby guppies, why not? Um, we can always replace that. Once we've got the guppies we need for the base prestige, we can always replace that with something a little bit more pow, 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 as it were. Let's carry on the harbour side paint here, because that's a bit of a, a thing we've got going on now. Uh, uh, yeah, that'll do. Sure. Uh, and this one just needs some planting there, right? Because it looks miserable otherwise. There is a... Uh, is it salt water? Salt water plants. I'm going to put an egg rack in because I hadn't seen one beforehand. We wanted to put one in before and couldn't. And do you know what? A couple of sea lettuce. Why not? Let's keep it simple. There we go. How about a bit of scenery? What have we got scenery that we haven't used yet? A compass. Boom. Ooh, mystical. Uh, we've unlocked the feeding tank platform. Nice. So that was kind of the last thing I wanted to do, really. Uh, let's go for the large RO machine, just in case we need it for this big tank that we're doing. Otherwise... That's okay. Arrow suggests there's people on it. They can come and see that. Let's get some of these. Hello. Hello. My word. All right. Wow. Okay. You've leveled up working, so you can get better at feeding. Why not? Jellies couldn't grow up. It's not big enough space. That's fine. You've leveled up as well. Nice. Learn feeding. Moon jelly couldn't grow up again or again. Okay. You can tell me that every day. So Guppy Fry is going to Guppy. The Paku is in that... In that Second tank are grown. Emerald and Emerald have got um, 
and an aqua guppy's pregnant as well. Nice. Okay, so this is this is good news. This is good news. So if we come into here, we've got three gu playing guppies that are. Oh no, I sold the fry again. Uh, it's really annoying how the order seems to change. Okay, and then move out of here. We're going to move that fry into there. Is that it? Everything else is good to go there. Okay. Um, what was the other thing? Oh yeah, moon jellyfish. Let's uh, let's do what we need to do here then. So here we've got two that just aren't growing. It's four and five. We can have three in there. That's it. Okay. Can we get some planting in there? I I got a feeling we can't. Is there space for? Oh, maybe there is. We can get a two a two wide plant in there. Oh yeah, let's do that. It looks a bit dull otherwise, doesn't it? I mean, I, they don't normally have that. It's normally the water's on a circle and they all kind of move with the water. But when there's only two in there, it's not great. Tobias, your legends. Get better at feeding, please, because that's going to start being the problem now. He's feeding. We've got to get them all fed. Um, so how are we doing now? We're at 3,000. We're at 3,000 and we've got an empty tank here. Let's have a look here. Pancho. Fixing. Paku has grown up to size 35. What? Pregnant Guppy. Pregnant Guppy. Pregnant Guppy. And Wade, the little legend, is going to get good at cleaning. Okay. Okay. And we've got, lo we've got so much money, it's ridiculous. So I say we go... All out. It's going to be a long video. I'm sorry, folks. But I want to get this episode finished. I want to get this level finished in this episode. Let's go all out and build a feeding platform tank. So, let me see what it says. Guess we'll get a kick out of watching your staff feed from this tank suspending feeding platform. I really... This is probably best suited to sharks, right? But... Oh, that's really annoying. Um, how do we how do we do this so it looks fine? I think we do it like that. Okay. So let's wall that off. Okay. I mean, ooh, we're going to have to move the stairs on this into a less practical position, but I can, I'm just going to have to learn to be okay with it. And then this can come down here. Okay. So that's fine. That leaves that area open that side, but also we're going to have to have a wall there, right? And this, and this area... Yeah, that's that's okay. That's acceptable. Right. So let's paint in the floor so we can really see the space we've got working for us. So this can be all harbour side paint. Uh, like that. And then we can have uh, minimal, which is what we've been using for backstage on this level. Uh, all across there so we know at a glance. Yeah? Okay, this place is busy, busy. Okay. So what are we going to stick in here? What have we got that could go in here that's like a decent size? Panther groupers, we've got those. Is there anything we haven't got that's a decent size? Five, four, tiny little fish. French angelfish get up to ten, that's not terrible. The sharks, we've already got quite a few of the sharks. Atlantic pilot we've got. Mackerel, cold water. The problem with the cold water was it does limit us. Into what we can put in. Uh, we've got a lot of coral we haven't put in. Do we have some coral in there maybe? Fresh water. We've got fresh water that we haven't put in. Corys, they're tiny. Red catfish we've got. Pacus we've got. We don't have... We've got no sharks. That's one of the big problems. I'm assuming sharks turn up at rank 9. Because we've got hardly any sharks, which is no good. And there's only an angel fish. Right, I guess we go salt water then and just see if we can get a lot of fish in the one tank, right? So what have we not got at all? And we'll start with that. So these we haven't got any 
butterfly fish or banner fish. I'm assuming they need sh they shoal, so that's fine. That's a nice start then, I guess. See, small fish are fine if they shoal because it looks good, right? So we'll take schooling banner fish. Let's take six of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. They don't look that small. That's cool. Okay, I didn't really read about these properly. Let's have a look. So water and stuff. Yeah, okay. So they need plants. But otherwise, that's a pretty basic fish. So we haven't got to worry too much about that now. What have we else have we not got here? Uh, so you should be able to go in as far as that's concerned. Yeah, okay. I think we can get a few of them in. One, two, three. Uh, lionfish, we've got sharks, we've got... There must be something else. Uh, hot, okay, so you're hot. So you're a wimp, that's not a pro major problem. They'll eat starfish, that's not a major problem. You're armoured, okay. No reason why we can't have two of those in there. Cold, cold. So humpback snapper. Need three of you. Uh, you will eat, oh, you'll eat stuff. So you'll eat stuff up to size six. Now these are, are these six? You're only five now, so I'm not going to risk it with those then. That's a shame. Uh, what else? That's probably, you know, because I think one of the, one of those other things that had a bit of an issue with coral, right? So let's start from the top. Uh, hot, hot, shoal, reef squirrel fish, dislike lights, that's fine. Yeah, no reason why we can't have those in, I don't think. So we're basically going for like a big tropical tank here to finish off with. That's pretty special, I think. Here, what about you? You eat things, that's no good. Dislikes food, can't put I don't know what I don't know what the food's like here, to be honest with you. What what does it say? Uh green no, there's stuff already in there with green pellets, that's no good. Uh active swimmer, maybe the unicorn surgeon fish, let's have a look. You have green pellets, but you don't mind other stuff having green pellets. You warm. Uh you need the space. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what else? Shoulder. Oh, we put those in already. You can't be with other Gorgonians. No, I, th I think they're Gorgonians, right? No, hold on. Which ones are Gorgonians? I can't remember what the hell a Gorgonian is. Because they don't use the name Gorgonian here. That's the problem. What about you? Cannot be housed with any non lionfish, or you're no good. You eat stuff, you're no good. You'll eat crustaceans, but nothing else. And you'll grow pretty decent size after 10 days. Boom. Let's throw two sharks in there as well to finish off with. I feel. I feel like we've got a lot of. A lot of fish in there. Let's get the, let's get the temps up. Where's that massive thing? Mega heater. It's going to mega heater on there. Okay. And let's get a mega double filter on there. Oh, size this thing. All right. So we'll get we'll get a stairway up. Oops. A stairway up and round there. Yeah. Okay, and then let's get one of everything they eat here, if we can. Can we line it up? Oh, here we can line all the food up along the back here. So, they need, let's see it from here, they need sand eels. Uh, green, you need green and orange pellets. Green pellet. Orange pellet. One seven. Oh, oh, okay. That's sorry. That's because we haven't got a door in there. That's causing us a, pro a bother. There, isn't it? Staff door. 
We've lost a bit of wall there, look. It's as it's when the, the door went over it, I think, it disappeared. Look, it's disappearing. When the door goes over it. And I bet I can't put it back in there, can I? Hmm, that's a weird bug, isn't it? What a strange bug. Okay, I'm pretty sure that is a bug. Let's just own it then and say that it's open. You can see all through it, whatever. Um, staff door, anyway. Yes. There. Okay, now we can see what food they still need, which is spong. Oh, sponge. <laughs> spong. I like to eat spong. Okay, now they have all the food they need, uh, but it's not all close. So we also need cockles and supplements. I want everything here so that it's easy to get to. And they're going to get all the food they need from there. Okay. So we've now got to get 30 plants... Four caves and ten rocks. So that's pretty easy because the caves and the rocks will probably be knocked out in one go with this slate thing, which I'm kind of in love with now. Oh, no, we need some more rocks. Okay. Uh, rubble classes are seven. It's rubble it is. And just some little... There we go. There's the rocks you need. So last thing is 30 plants. 30 plants. And this is this is salt water, isn't it? Okay, so what's got what's a good plant rating here? Nine on the velvet horn. Nine on the old velvet horn. So there, that gives us 18. Kelp. Gotta be done. We love it. This is the big finish. Let's get some kelp in there. Only really gives us two per thing, which isn't great. And then hopefully there's something else we can finish off with. Okay, I don't get. I know that's enough, but I'm, I want a bit more kelp. That is a cool tank to finish off with. Look at that. And now I'm hoping all that. Whoa! Look at the points coming in from that bad boy. Yes. I mean, really superb. So. Let's just uh, let's finish this off with a couple of these things then. So let's get a science poster. Can we do a science poster for this? Okay, that's a bit out of the way, but that's fine. And um, we could do with it. I mean, there's an obvious spot there is for trash. Oh, she's done it again. Look at her. Look cheeky. Come here. Boom. Right. So that was our last. That was our last big tank. All right. They come up here and feed. Look, they love it. And we've got the large RO machine done. I mean, there really isn't anything I don't think we need now. Toilet, why not? We'll replace the toilets if we're still here. And we've unlocked the lump sucker. Uh, blue and yellow grouper. Butterfly ram. What's that one? Fluffy foliage lover. Uh, let's go for that coral. And we'll do a coral here. with Maybe we could do a coral with some, with some Nemo's in or something. I don't know. Uh, Lorenzo's leveled up. Oh, Lorenzo, you're superb. Look at that. Cobra guppy's pregnant, and one of those guppies has had babies. So let's come over here and move your into here. Nice. Let's just see what this does. This takes a while to feed, but they're all coming and doing it. Now, are people actually getting up here? Because that's my worry, is I don't think they are. I think maybe we need to move this. To suggest people go that way instead. Somebody commented that these don't work. I, I, I really don't know whether they do or not, you know. They used to. I'm sure they used to. Let's see. Let's see if that there pushes people up here. Just don't know whether it does. Because one thing we have done... He's made like three little loops now. Look, we've got a loop here, we've got a loop here, and we've got a loop here. That I Yeah, I'd say more people are getting up. I think those arrows do something. It might not be a definite, but it's definitely a good suggestion, I think. So Claire's leveled up. Let's learn how to clean up a bit, Claire. You've learned how to clean as well. Catfish has grown. Nice. Catfish has grown. Catfish has grown. That's great. Bread puppies. Uh, guppies. We've made puppies as well. We're a puppy farm too now. Okay, why not? So let's move all the fry into there. Okay. So let's just see if we've got any problems anywhere. I don't think we're having any issues with people growing up, like animals growing up, 
size wise i feel like we're doing all right you know what was the one we missed and xavier that's a cool name xavier um i'd like xavier for xander but technically didn't so we went for xander in the end similar ish you know do you know what i'm gonna move that I've just thought what we can do. I'm going to move you to there. Why not? One thing we haven't done this level is used any of these podiums. Now, these podiums mean uh, people can come and stand on them and give them a talk. So if we put that there and then give them a headset. Where is it? Mic headset. There we go. We'll put it there. Okay. And then we can come to this podium. And we can talk about... We need prestige, don't we? So talk about the shark. Start time at 9. Go for it. Fill your boots. And we've unlocked the Dulux toilet. Or Dulux, if you like. Um, do any of these... I don't know, I'll get a feeding stick. Why not? Um, I'm going to sell all the toilets. Uh... Oh, there was somebody in it. I, my apologies. I wonder why it was asking me if I really wanted to clear that. Yes, sell. If somebody's in it. I don't need you to. If if somebody's in it, I'm not want. I don't want to sell the person. Taking a dump. There we go. I don't like the deluxe ones as much because they don't they don't fit in my nice little cubby holes as well. It might not even be enough toilet. Oh, there's two here. I was gonna say that probably isn't enough toilets. Deluxe toilets. This is all we're interested in now is making prestige. So there's there are places where we don't have uh, these things. Right? So we need to get some of these in because these all help. Science. This one has one. This. Is there something in there? Oh yeah, lionfish doesn't have one. Nah. That's ridiculous. I can't go there. We can't do that. How about here? Ah, that's a little too far. How about here? That would be okay. Let's move you a little. Okay. All of this helps. Three, two, seven. Oh, man. We're still. We ain't going to hit it, you know? We're earning so much points. What's going on here? Paku's grown. Nice. That helps. Guppy has grown. Nice. Guppy. Guppy. Jimmy's leveled up. Feed. Please, Jimmy. Kel. Uh, oh, no. Fix. That was meant to be. Never mind. Uh, Guppy Fry to there. And Aqua Guppy and Emerald Guppy to here. Mostly emeralds we're getting. Have we got any of those new ones yet? No. That's a shame. I can't keep up with this. Oh, the Balan Rass has grown. Uh, can... Wait, where are you? You can eat stuff now? I missed, I've missed a thing. You can now eat stuff as well. Oh, no. Balan Ras, where are you? Balan Ras. Where are you, Balan Ras? No. Balan Ras. Oh, you're fine. You're not gonna you you ain't eating a you ain't eating him. And I and I feel like the Longhorn can eat stuff. Starfish one to four. Was that what was it was it Longhorn? Cowfish. Longhorn cowfish. You can eat stuff. Yeah, not a problem. Carry on. Like I, said, I thought I'd really spent a lot of time making sure that was right. So now we've got a bit of a quandary now. Because it looks like even with our incredible um, feeding tank at the end there, we're not close to our 3,500. 
We've got one tank left to fill. We ain't going to stick something in there that's going to earn us 500 prestige points a day. So I suppose we continue working on our guppies, because this is going to give us 300 a day, which is which might mean we tip it, okay? Um, and there's that one tank there as well. And there's probably a few other things, podiums. I think, actually, I'm going to have to leave it here and carry on this one in the next one. I really thought we'd smash it, but maybe not. Guppies grown, Paku's grown. All these things help. That can't help because there's no space. Okay, I'd like you to grow up, actually. So let's have a look at why you can't. I assume there's too many Ballion Rasses in there. Uh, 61 out of 64. Yeah, so let's get rid of a Ballon Rass. Okay. What's up with you? You haven't been fed? Well, that'll, that'll work itself out. Uh... Yeah, okay. I think we're going to have to leave it there. Next episode, we will um, we'll hopefully finish this one off. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. Till the next one, be good. Coffee machine. <laughs>